Hey guys, Brandon here, Minton Made Properties. We have your Wayne County May 2021 real estate market update. We're gonna try to get this in before the sun goes down. So time me. May 2021, we have the month in arrears. We have the data hot off the press for you. And we have three years of data because the trend is your friend. It wouldn't make sense to just have one year. So that's why we always have three. I always preface with those two things. Let's jump right into this. Days on market. We had over 40 days two years ago, over 50 days last year, and then 26 were over half uh, of the homes. Uh, it cut in half over last year, the days on uh, market, the time it takes you to sell your home. Active number of homes. This is a one day data sample across the county. How many homes were there on that given day? So 4,800 two years ago, 4,300 last year, and then 2,500 this year. So truly remarkable what's going on. Again, this number is in half basically. Uh, so again, prices go up. And this ratio will tell you quick here next what's going on just in one number. Months of inventory, 2.4 last year, or two years ago, excuse me, just over five last year, and then 1.4 this year. So we're looking at you know five, six weeks of inventory, big cuts here. And that's at the rate homes are selling. How long would it take to sell every last home if no new home came in the market? Well, in this case, it's about five, six weeks. That's remarkable. So one to three months is a seller's market, four to six is a balanced market, seven plus is a buyer's market, meaning there's a lot of inventory and prices have come down like 10, 12 years ago. New homes in the market, 3,577 two years ago, 2,932 last year, and 2,814 this year. So we're still down. This is the number of homes that came in the market across the entire month in that county. We're still down going forward. You think that pent up demand would be there? Well, it's not, still going down. What does that do to prices? Probably gonna go up unless there's big catastrophic everything bubble events going on. Uh, the real estate market is not going anywhere unless those big, massive uh, global uh, events happen. $97, uh, is a, or $97 a square foot two years ago. We had $82 last year and then 128 this year. Again, you're seeing that dip because of the lockdowns, but 128, we're seeing massive rises all across the county. That's, if you take that 128 and you multiply it by your square footage, you're gonna get approximately what your value is your home but that's a countywide number. So if you want a true valuation, you need someone on our team, an appraiser, a true professional to come actually value your home and give you what it's worth. This is more important to just see the trend here. Number of sold properties. This is the number of people actually exchanging deeds, signing at a closing table across the entire, uh, entire month. Over 2,000 two years ago, we had only uh, 900, almost 900 last year, and then 1,793, so almost 1,800 this year. So again, we're down a little bit. This is the same across all of Metro Detroit. And uh, we're, we were down obviously last year because of the lockdowns. But uh, again, it's a, it's a small number, and we'd like to see that the, the velocity pick up, but when there's not a lot of inventory, people are fighting over things, it's gonna be tough. So I don't see what's gonna change much going forward in the real estate world unless there's huge, massive, overarching things that happen and that topple those dominoes and knock into real estate and collapse it, real estate itself is not gonna go anywhere uh, and just in a silo. You know, things aren't in a vacuum though, right? And that's why I mentioned those dominoes, those macro global economic things going on. But just itself, real estate, hurt for home. So prices are gonna stay elevated. Appreciate you guys. That's a Wayne County update for May, 2021. Appreciate your time, your attention, your energy. It's the most important asset we have. Uh, if you're on the podcast, go to the YouTube or Facebook channel at Legacy Group MI, at Legacy Group MI. And uh, question, comment there. We will get back to you as soon as possible. And we'll see you guys on the next one.